So what do you think of this new turbo setup? You know, I was looking around for my file the other day. Yeah. How you doing? So single turbo. Uh, forgot to hook up this tube for the wastegate. So it was running uh, something like almost 20 pounds of boost a little bit ago. Pushed a little bit of water. I hope the engine's okay. It doesn't, still doesn't run the greatest. That's okay. Next weekend, uh, out for blood. This thing is going to run some kind of decent time or it's going to blow up trying. I don't, and I don't care which because it's the last race of the season as far as I know. And um, then I'll have all winter to work on it, right? Okay. Going without a hood because if I put a hood back on it, I'll have to change up my cold side piping here, which is just what I had. Dry nozzle with a 150 jet, in, or I'm sorry, it's a 62 thousandths jet, should be about a 150 horse. Someone correct me if I'm wrong. Meth nozzle, but I've just got E85 in the tank. Um, I'll put meth in it. So for those of you that don't know what's going on here, I had twins on this thing, or twins 7268s, bought them for a 383, ended up with a, uh, 325 or whatever the heck this is a 5.3 liter 99 silverado took the turbo off put that plate on put up a pipe joining the two together uh this wastegate i'm just gonna stay there no hose hook up to it it'll be fine this one i just gotta hook the hose up to it i'm gonna go ahead and run uh probably 12 pounds and hope it lives. All it's got to do is drive there and race and drive home, right? Uh, how about that Duesenberg? It is so much quieter. Like, it wasn't loud before, but it's like super nice and quiet now. So, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Still tuning it with EFI Live. I'm still having a hard time. I cannot get this thing to run rich enough. I'm running E85 through a decapped factory Silverado injector. It should be around 75 pound an hour. But no matter what I do, even cruising it down the road, I cannot get this thing to, to richen up. Uh, full throttle, it's running about, it, it maintains about 12 to 1. And what 11, 11 to one is what you want. Um, even just cruising down the road, I think maybe with the 85. Now I'm running on the gas scale for those of you that are wondering. Uh, this O2 Innovate O2 sensor doesn't read or it doesn't display lambda. So that's a lesson learned on my part. The next time I will get one that displays lambda. All right. You know, whenever you've used a term for years and you thought you knew the meaning of it, but then found out that you've been using the word wrong this whole time, and now you feel stupid because someone had to, had to correct you? Well, as it turns out, I've never been a lesbian. <laughs>